Going to make this bike a little bit lighter, switching out the handlebars right here to a carbon fiber set from RXL SL right there, and also a stem. This happens to be a 80 millimeter uh, stem. You can mount this one either six degrees um, up or down, depending upon the uh, comfort of the rider and how you want the bars to be uh, positioned once the rider is on there. So once again, a six degree up or down, depends upon how you want it mounted there. And then this nice set of uh, carbon fiber bars also from RXLSL. So let me show you how it's done. It's really simple. Uh, biggest thing you want to do is make sure when you take off the stem uh, right here down to the fork that you have this supported somehow. It's on a bike stand right now. So I'm going to support it with a, a strap here to make sure it doesn't fall all the way through once I loosen the top of it up there. But this is a great set of uh, carbon fiber bars. Check it out and watch along, guys. All right, you're going to need a 4 millimeter and a 5 millimeter hex uh, wrench. And to go along with that, you're going to want a uh, torque wrench with also a 4 millimeter and a 5 millimeter attachment. Once again, that's on the torque specs of the, the stem and the bars. Uh, keep in mind you're dealing with carbon fiber and you don't want to crack it. So between six, between four and six newton meters is how you want to uh, cinch those down. And then we'll also be using some fiber grip uh, in between the two carbon fiber uh, materials there. I'm going to use some rubber gloves when using that. Uh, so there they are. All right, obviously when doing so, you want to remove all the handlebar grips, the brake levers, uh, dropper post to get ready to take the, uh, the stem off with the handlebars. Uh, this stem is going to be a five millimeter. It's going to be able to take the uh, center of the stem and then these two pieces right there. Um, this one is a, it's going to be a four. So a four on these ones and a five on the top. All right, so the stem is on here now with the top cap there. So this uses a five millimeter and a four millimeter. And on the opposite side is the opposite. So a four millimeter is gonna be on the top and a five millimeter on the bottom. So that's what that is to get that adjusted and stayed. Now you're gonna to wanna to use the torque wrench, torque those down to the specs. And then these ones up here, um, use a four millimeter. All right, so here's the set of bars I'm installing. This is the Pro um, RXLSL set. Um, it has a grippy material in the center here, uh, right by like the logo. Uh, when you put the stem on this one, you want to torque it down to five newton meters. Uh, no more than five newton meters with the carbon fiber, um, otherwise it could crack. Um, there it is. Nice. To, I like the shininess of this uh, set of bars. It's really cool and like the logo and stuff on there. I'm going to mount this one up there and we'll give it a look there. All right, so this is where you're going to apply your fiber grip. And I just put a little bit on this side, this side, and then like the top right there. You'll see. And I rub it in with uh, this rubber glove I have on because you don't want to get this stuff on your skin if you don't have to. So there that is. You can always wipe off the excess. Make sure none of it goes down in the tube. You just want it applied like that. And obviously you don't want to um, put any down where those bolts are going to go. We'll make sure that's all clean in there. So you got the fiber grip in there and then you just want to place that right there and then put the, uh, the face of the, the, the stem on there. I like how they put some nice measurements on the inside here so when adjusting it or um, lining it up makes it really easy. So when you put the face on here you want to clamp down the front of it so the bottom and the top have the same gap and then you want to start tightening and then then when you put the uh, torque wrench up here, five newton meters is all you want. 
set it to five newton meters. You want to start in the top left until it stops. Then I go down to the bottom right, bottom left, and now the top right will finish it off. Right there. All right, so there it is. It's all set to go with the stem, carbon fiber stem, and the handlebars from RX LSL. This happens to be the six degree um, up or down, depending upon how you mount it. They also make a 17 degree up or down, depending upon how you mount it once again. Um, also coming in the same lengths, the 120, the 110, 100, 90, and 80 millimeters in the uh, lengths there, depending upon the rider that you're trying to fit it for and the comfort level they're going for. So thanks for watching. Have a great day. We'll see you guys next time.